Hey, what's up, you guys? So I know it's been a while, and I'm sorry. It's because I'm a sophomore, and I'm currently majoring in nuclear engineering, and I'm in college. So I've been really busy since it's the last uh, semester for this year. I mean, well, for my sophomore year, and it's coming to an end. That means a lot of tests happen, and finals are coming up. So I've been just studying a whole lot. So I hadn't had time to really edit a video or really record. Well, I mean, I've recorded a few clips here and there, but I can't really have time to edit my videos. Like an hour or two of editing videos could be spent studying, and that's what I've been doing, guys. So I'm very sorry about that. So what you're about to see is a week 10 update. Um, I skipped week nine because there wasn't much going on, and uh, there wasn't much change in my physique. So I do hope you guys enjoy this video. I hope you guys can see the difference in the physique within two weeks and uh, I will get you guys cupped where my physique or where I'm at uh, currently soon uh, so just hopefully I can find more time to edit videos during uh, dead week so the week before finals and get you guys caught up to where I'm at right now and then you know maybe spend a couple more weeks getting more clips and then I will start busting out more videos on the daily for you guys. All right, so I hope you guys enjoy this video. I'll talk to you guys soon. Hey, what's up you guys? How's it going? I know it's been a while since I've done uh, this kind of episode. It's just because the last week, um, so last week I was just really busy because it was a week before spring break and I just had a, like, I had a couple of tests and a lot of stuff to do. So I didn't really have time to make a video, make a quality video for you guys. I was constantly either studying or doing homework. Oh God, I had to sneeze. Anyways, I'm back at home now and it's spring break, so I'm able to record a lot more for you guys, a lot better for you guys. So, first of all, you guys like my room, my room setup? So, when I leave for college, my mom just kind of used my room as a storage uh, space for all of her stuff. And we're, we're Catholics, we're, I come from a family of strict Catholics, so that's why my room is set up like this. Now, let me talk to you guys through my day today. So, I woke up and I weighed in and after that I got my first meal in which is Chipotle so I went to Chipotle and got my first meal of the day so if you're a fan of Chipotle or if you've never been to Chipotle you guys need to try out this combo right here so what I have here, what I'm eating right now is a triple white rice bowl with black beans double fajitas and 
double steak with an extra serving of chicken. So that's triple meat right there in total. And on the salsa, if you like spiciness, um, I get uh, medium sauce with hot sauce. If you don't like spiciness, get medium sauce with uh, corn. And mild on there too if you want. But that right there is an amazing bowl. If you guys haven't tried it, it's really should. So I'm gonna try and try and finish half of this and then save the rest for later. Then afterwards, I went to Dairy Queen and got my favorite blizzard there. My, uh, what is it? I got a strawberry cheesecake. By far the best, and it has kind of low fat, you know, for ice cream. Yeah. So I had a medium strawberry cheesecake blizzard from Dairy Queen. Then later on, I had to go get my uh, oil change for my car. So I'm waiting to get my oil change right now. And while I'm doing that, I'm editing my video. As you'll see, when shoppers add an item to their jet cards, they automatically trade the prices of millions of other Which you guys can see later on. It should be uploaded before this video, actually. All right, so let me explain further for yesterday. Today is my refeed day, which means it's kind of like a diet break. So a refi is good for anyone who's dieting. It allows them to have a mental break and also allows them to have to break completely, period, from the diet. So, you know, they're when they come back into it, they're more prepared and they're a lot better. Also, it really does help out athletes or people who are getting ready for a competition because as you diet, you get completely flat. And so yeah, if you guys can't tell, I'm more full today because this is my last and final day of refeed. So I look a little bit more full because my glycogen storage has been replenished. So I'm not as like flat as I usually am in my physique updates. Uh, it's actually time to get ready for the gym. So let's get ready for that. All right, now I'm ready for the gym. So let's head to the gym, guys. Now we're at the gym, and today I have rep work with uh, squat, bench, and deadlift. So, yeah, it's gonna be a fun day. It's hypertrophy day, also known as rep day. And on top of that, guys, my gym right here has the door open. So I can squat and get in fresh air at the same time, which is awesome. It's gonna be a good day. Let's get it. Even though my stomach feels a little bit queasy, queasy, it wasn't that bad. So let's go on and uh, do some bench, guys.
Alright guys, so here you guys can see that I'm doing my bodybuilding accessory lift at the end after I've finished my uh, main uh, movements, so, so the squat, bench, and deadlift. So this is how I'm doing my cut, and this is how I've always done it in the past too. It's called like power building, so I'll do my main powerlifting sets, uh, or my, yeah, like my powerlifting sets, my powerlifting movements first and then I'll do my bodybuilding accessory afterwards so these these you guys have seen me done them many times all I do is strive to progress each week each day with these accessory lifts and that's it anyways guys hope you guys enjoy this video thank you for watching give this video a like if you really like it subscribe if you haven't share and I'll see you guys in the next video alright peace